So real quick, I want to show you how to use this copper tape to try to eliminate the frustration that comes inevitably with trying to use it when you don't know how. So the copper tape is stuck on a white background, a backing paper, because by itself it's very flimsy. So your first goal is to get it detached from the white background. You don't want to just peel this whole length of tape off and then try to control it because it's not going to be controllable. It's very flimsy. It sticks to itself. It's a bad idea. So peel a little bit, stick it on your paper wherever you want to start, and then undo the white backing paper as you slowly smooth the copper tape to whatever it's next supposed to be stuck to. When you're done, you can easily just rip it with your finger, and that's it. So you don't have to worry about getting scissors to cut it. It's very, very flimsy, as I said. Where people run into more problems is when they try to go around a corner. So on some of your templates, you have corners like this. And the best way to go around that corner, notice it tells you, continuous strip of foil. Don't try to do a straight piece and another straight piece because the adhesive on the bottom is less conductive. So instead, peel back a bit, start it. When you get close to the corner, you want to start turning the foil and just squish it down with your finger until it is back on the next straight path. It doesn't matter too much if it looks like garbage. What matters is that you have that continuous strip of foil that's going to allow the current to flow. So again on this next corner, I'm going to just really manipulate the foil with my fingers, being bigger and stronger than it, making it do what I want it to do. So again, go around that corner without ripping the foil. And then I can just continue to peel the paper backing off until I reach the end of my template here and just rip. So you are in control of it. If it's smoother, it works a little better. So I like to go back and smooth it down against the paper. Last little example, you can see, same thing. Start a bit, stick it down, follow the path, turn the corner, and then peel it off the paper backing, making sure to follow the diagram very carefully. 